Hi you guys and welcome to another unboxing. Today I got this in the mail. Indeed from Germany released Kujo today. The long-awaited Kujo media books are available right now. I pre-ordered this one on August 10th already. Oh wow, well. well protected. Bubble wrap and what is this? A postcard? Well that's a nice idea. Um, actually, I've been in talks with Indeed Films since January 2019. What is going on with Kujo? And now we finally received this one. This is cover B, by the way. And um, yeah, limited to 444 copies. I received number 282. Um, so let's check out what we received inside. This is a four disc set, two Blu-rays, two DVDs, and a booklet of 48 pages. Oh, come on. So, there we go. Beautiful, and here, we have a glossy script. Nothing is embossed though. The print is really sharp on this one. The Wallace and the kit on the front and the St. Bernard. So, so press the pause button if you want to read this. Let's start off with the front. And uh, this is the first official release here in Germany on Blu-ray. It's a HD premiere. All the others were bootleg bootlegs only. Um, the only official release was a DVD by EMS Studio back in the days with awful picture. <laughs> you can't really call this a an official release, but this one is a official release for sure. Thank God we finally received one here. And uh, I hate these trays. You always feel like damaging something. So this is, gosh, um, what is it? The Blu-ray, which version is it? Oh, it's a bit hard to tell right now which version we have because um, we have the director's cut coming with this edition. We have the theoretical cut, which is restored for this edition. edition. And um, the same thing, on the Blu-rays, I hope this is moving, yes. So I don't know what what we have on what disc. So this is the DVD, but it's not saying which cut is on it. Well, I will show you the booklet in a second, but let's get these out first. Uh, an Albtraum wird Wirklichkeit, a nightmare becomes reality. Oh, here is it. Uh, this is the German theoretical version. So the others is the director's cut and this is the, what is this here? The DVD. So on the left side, what I showed, what I showed first was the um, director's cut and on the right side, the theoretical version. So this is a full picture. Wait a second, I make this sharp. Yes. It's a, it's a great print with all the different artworks available. Hunde die Bellen beißen. Oh yeah, that's a German saying. Dogs who bark, they bite. And indeed they do. This is what it means over there. Um, some notes by Stephen King who turned uh, 75. Uh, the day before yesterday, on September 21st. This is um, cover A, by the way. You could also order this one, which is beautiful, beautiful print. I really, I was undecided at first which one to get, A or B, but I decided to get cover B. I like that best. So these are indeed the other artworks that were available. Um, in total, there were six dogs, six different dogs used for the filming of Cujo, six uh, St. Bernard's, the dogs from Switzerland.
and the paper is great on this one. Of course, it's a lot of text, but um, I prefer text to pictures most of the time. So here we have, I'll show this a little closer, the full content, what this edition comes with, and um, the director's cut, um, no, it was the theoretical cut that has been restored for this edition. Well, I'll try to show this a little closer. And the theoretical version. Well, it's nice that they listed all these uh, contents that you don't have to put in the disk to find out what's on it. Well, yeah, these pictures look like a bit washed out, but it, this is, I think, due to the age of the movie and the sources they used. Oh yeah, this, <laughs> this one is indeed a little blurry with that boy lying in the bed. But I think it's, it's really fitty for the movie and the age of the movie. I mean, the movie is from 1983. Yeah, Dee Wallace, um, you might know her and recognize her from E.T., the extraterrestrial, where she is the mother of little Elliot. And uh, what I also want to point out is that Jan de Bon, the cameraman of this one, the Dutch uh, director who later turned into be uh, a director, he brought us um, Speed with Keanu Reeves, Die Hard with Bruce Willis and Twister. Yes, um, here you can, it's a bit tiny, but you might can read this uh, when you push the pause button. I like this when they publish the sources they used at the end of the booklet. So um, uh, let's check it out from here. It's really uh, a high class production, very stable. The spine also comes with a glossy script over here. Can you see this now? Overall, and on the back as well, overall, a very beautiful edition. And um, it's like I said at the very beginning, um, I've been in talks with Indeed Film since January 2019, and, and it took them a real long time to get this thing uh, released. I don't know why this took so long. I think all the restoration, the different sources they used, um, I don't know. Um, it really took some time. But, Sometimes uh, good things take a while and yeah, it's the first official HD release here in Germany. So, so thank God this now sees the daylight and uh, I can enjoy Kuju besides this one, which I got from England, Eureka Entertainment. Um, I think they pulled a lot of bonus over from the English edition. I will post all the bonus features in the description of the video for sure. Uh, which is a lot. I think um, there's one, I think one is missing one of the bonus features from the uh, Eureka release, which was only available on the uh, limited edition, the uh, really expensive limited edition, which I miss, unfortunately. This is what they don't feature on this one, but um, I think the making of is included, which is about 40 minutes long, and as well the um, very long interview with the Wallis is included. The only thing I think that is missing is the uh, question and answer thing with that dog trainer that is missing, I think, on this one, I think, probably due to copyright issues. But anyways, that was Kujo. So thanks for watching and have a great weekend, guys. Bye.